Reading the reports from the various areas and nations gives one the strong affirmation that the Lord is alive and is in his church to prove himself faithful through signs and wonders. To the glory of God, the church continued to record remarkable healings, deliverance from satanic oppression and several miracles, a few of which have been documented in session 4.11.11 of the brochure. I, however, want to share three of these spectacular events with you. To the glory of God, in Hoho area, a brother declared dead was brought back to life. Brother Daniel Kweku Cabre of the Amanya community, an idol worshiper, was declared dead by a medical doctor at the Orara Government Hospital. He was to be sent to the mortuary upon the doctor's declaration. However, the surprise of the, to the surprise of the nurses and the doctors at the facility, his seven-year-old son, a children's ministry member of the Amenia Assembly, by the name Emmanuel Kofi Pento, said he would not allow them to take his father to the mortuary and that he should be allowed to pray for the father to wake up. The boy, upon per permission, prayed for the father to be brought back to life. After the prayer, they went ahead with the body towards the mortuary, but on their way, the dead body started shaking. <laughs> and as a result, he was rushed back to the doctor for medical attention. By God's grace, he was restored to life. Surrendered his life to Christ, and together with his wife, both were baptized in June 26, 2022. They are currently members of the Church of Pentecost. At Koyokumi District in Gorsi area, Derek Amponsa, a six-year-old boy, unable to walk and talk since birth, received his speech and got on his feet for the first time in six years after he was prayed for. Elder King George Aqua of Ot uh, in, in Canada testified how God healed his son. He recounted that his son had a hole in his upper palate and doctors had scheduled him for surgery. Upon prayers, God miraculously healed his son and the hole was closed by itself without any surgical procedure. To God be all the glory.